What are you doing? All right, so we're gonna grab a crock pot, right? Some of this right here. You like that? Yeah. Yeah, I know. Who doesn't like Funfetti Oreo, right? And then we're gonna grab, I don't know, man, what is this? Like six tablespoons of butter. And then we need like 40, but it's like 42 ounces, but I guess it said it's like 40 ounces, but I think it'd be the same thing. Uh, some apple uh, pie filling, or you can cut your own apples and use regular apples in there. But this is what we're gonna go with right here. So first thing we gotta do is, we gotta open up the jaw. I've always loved this can opener. Ready? I'm gonna show you why. Watch. Super robust. I mean, yeah, you can get an electric one, but I never do. Just look how fast that was, watch. No sharp edges. Wee! All right, so this is what we're gonna do, guys, ready? So we're gonna dump all of the apples pie filling in the bottom of a crock pot. Now we're supposed to like coat the bottom really well. So I guess you can use whatever kind of cake mix you want. And I thought that going with an Oreo uh, Funfetti one would be even better. But you can use a yellow cake, white cake, this cake, that cake, red velvet cake. Why am I using such a big night cake? So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab some cinnamon, right, like this. I'm gonna take this out of the box. We're just gonna put a bunch of cinnamon in there. How much, however much you want. Get that, get it moved into the cake mix. We're not doing anything homemade because we don't have time, all right? So we're gonna dump it all in. Look, it mixed in really well. And we're gonna keep this on the top. We are not mixing the apples with it. Add out the cake mix, like a so. A little bit more of a cinnamon sugar, right? I'm using a cinnamon toast crunch but that's got more of a sugary. Mostly melt it, right? Now we're supposed to just pour it in over the cake mix on top and, and do not stir, but we can smooth it because some of that didn't melt, right? So we wanna coat all of it as much as we can. That's it? That's it. Now I guess we got four to six hours. I'm gonna go on high for four hours. I guess we wanna go on low for six, it says. And this thing should be done. And we're gonna see what this thing looks like in four hours. I'm going on high. Okay, so it's been about five hours on high. All right, you guys ready? Now, keep in mind, there's Oreos in there. So when you see the, the black things, that's the cookies. Look at that right there. Doesn't that look delicious? Yeah. Apple cobbler dump cake in a crock pot. And remember, you can use any kind of cake you want. Right, and that's dry mix. So there's no eggs, no nothing. And I guess all we do is now is we scoop some up like this, right? That's a big piece. You can see the apples in the oh, bottom. Oh yeah, they're hot. This is really, really hot, right? But what goes good with that, right? A scoop of vanilla ice cream. That would only complete it, right? There you go. And I got the Oreos in there because I really wanted to jazz it up. Amazing. If you didn't know I made this in a crock pot, you'd think I slaved over the oven all day. I meant for a dump cake, and wow, with them Oreos in there. I need to get out there and make this.